everybody, it's Antenna Dragon Gamer, and welcome to the second half of this part of Let's Play Pokemon Black and White. Now, um, where we left off is where we went to the Desert Resort, and now I'm just going to go heal my Pokemon, and we're going to head west to Drift City, or however you call it, I never really get these names correctly, to be honest. Since, I mean, I've only gotten this game a little over a month ago, so. And I'll show you my Art Sheops one more time. It is a really good Pokemon. I highly recommend you get it. Well, I got the cover fossil, which is that water rock type. I'll give that to eight. I will make eggs of eight of that Pokemon to give to eight one some ball. Since he doesn't have one and he only has an Archon fossil. Um So we pretty much covered everything in the city and now we're gonna head west. And my Pokemon I'm gonna evolve will be by Paul Pitoad, which is one level away from evolving. Three of my Pokemon are one level away from evolving. My Dragzilla is going to take a little bit longer. Oh, there's Charon! Steven, stop! You've, you've got a Bolt Badge. I've got a Bolt Badge. Let's test our sh who's stronger, you or me. This time, I'm going to win. Well, I really like the enthusiasm, but I'm going to win. I'm 10 levels higher than you. Leopard. This will help my Pokemon evolve, most definitely. Muddy Water. So much I just hate Fake Out, it's just annoying. Close, do what? Let's see. Nah, I'll I'll figure that out later. Use uproar. Citrus berry. Thank God, still using uproar. Okay. Level 36. Let's send up Paganite. Roll out. Let's send out stealth. Thin attack. Ah, cheap! I hate protect and detect. They're so annoying.
No. God. Hate that move. <sighs> Mind you, I'll never, I, it's not over yet. Okay, poison jab. God! Ugh. Really irritating and annoying. Like, really irritating and annoying. Thank you. That's better. Now we're going to see my Palpitoad evolve into a Semitoad. Let's get rid of Aqua Ring. Why? Why can't I beat you? Um, there's the uh, fourth gym leader, Elisa. Oh, you two are friends. That's nice. How you're helping each other get better by competing? Okay, let's go. And oh, why if it isn't Elisa? Aren't festivals grand? Life should be enjoyed. Who is this man? This is Alder, the Unova region's champion. Champion? Why would the champion be goofing off in a place like this? I heard that remark, you're quite a judgmental young person, are you not? My name is Alder, I'm the Unova Pokemon League's champion, pleased to make your acquaintance. For your information, I'm not goofing up, I'm on a voyage, I know every corner of Unova. Um, I'm Charon, from Novema Town, Vuma Town. My goal as a trainer is to become the champion. Hmm, traveling with a goal in mind as is a com commendable thing. And what do you plan to do after becoming the champion? Ooh, what else is there other than striving to become stronger? The strongest trainer, that's the champion. Hmm, becoming stronger, becoming stronger, you say? Is that alone? enough of a goal, hmm? It's not that. I'm trying to say your way of thinking is wrong. In my travels, I've helped many people learn to love Pokemon, and I think that's important too. If you play with those children, you might gain more, uh, gain more of an understanding. Why you two have why you two have Pokemon battle with those two? Hey, you two, come over here for a moment. Understood. Before that... Okay, let's battle. It looks like we're going to go up against these preschoolers. And they're going to go down, most definitely. Yeah, they're going to go down. Muddy water.
They should both be taken out. That would be funny, though. What? Okay, I have to say females, I guess, survive better than, uh, better than a male, I guess. Work up raises attack and special attack. Acid. My Pokemon's not gonna have more speed because Leopard has more. My Pokemon are so cute. My Pokemon listened to what I said and fought for me. Huh. <laughs> Nicely done. You didn't win, but that was a good battle. Your Pokemon looked like they were having fun. Young man, if there are people like you who pursue strength, there are also people who are happy just being with Pokemon. There are many different people and many different answers. When it comes to what a champion should be, you and I may hold differing views, but so be it. Give it some thought. Let's roll. Driftville, the Driftville Drawbridge is just ahead. The champion is the strongest. The strong. That's all there is to it. Yeah, Charon, you're really not putting much thought to it. Okay, we're going to try and evolve more Pokemon, so... We're going to put Pig Knight in first. Yes, for the rest of this part, after the Gym Leader and Bianca as the rival, we're going to... We are going to end this part. Yes, yes, yes. Protect. Silly clown. Musician. Blitzel. It'd be ironic if this Pokemon also used Flame Charge on me and survived. But most likely not. Use another Flame Charge.
I'm gonna have to skip this battle too. Another backpacker. I guess they. I guess what I'm thinking is, Game Freak decided to replace the hikers with backpackers. I most possibly will show you on the bottom screen, like when I'm doing all my editing, I'll be showing what Pokemon you could find in the grass. Like I did in part 9, I'll probably be doing that in some, and I probably already did it in some other parts also, so. There's an item, so I need to go get it. Okay, you can find a great ball over here. Okay, I'm gonna do this just because my Pig Knight's gonna evolve after I faint this Pokemon. What did I call what did I say? My pig knight's gonna evolve. I get rid of flame charge. I want varieties of moves because I need a dark move. Just because there has there needs to be variety. All right, Pig Knight is gonna evolve into Embor. There you have it, Embor. Let's look at his stats. Pretty good. Okay, now I send out my Dragzilla. And, um... I'll need to show you something that you will need to get, and I need to show you something in this part that I forgot to get because, um, you need HM4 strength. You will need HM4 strength. It's going to take a lot longer to level up my my Dragzilla. Okay, we found a revive. Okay, I gotta get this done real quick. We need to head to that next city. I know you guys have probably been waiting for a very long time now. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I'm trying to put as much as I can. I don't remember exactly. Is it in this building you talk to a guy who's gonna give you HM4? Okay. Hold on just a second. Okay, I'm in the right spot. I was talking to the wrong person. Okay, thank goodness. Alright, thank goodness. Okay, I'll meet you back at the Now to contact him. It's me, Elisa. Please lower the drawbridge. A couple of trainers here want to challenge you. Okay, thanks. Now watch this.
That's pretty cool. Well, you're a model, so go. Well, I am as a trainer. I prove I'm right by getting stronger and winning in battle. I'm even against the champion. Hmm. So you're the trainer Salisa was talking about, huh? I'm Clay. I'm the gym leader around round these parts. Don't be expecting no welcome now, cause when we lower that bridge, the team plasma guys we caught don't escape in all the ruckus. What a bother. We're grateful that you lowered the bridge, but how is it our fault that they escaped? You can say whatever you want, but what's important is you all showed up and then Team Plasma escaped. Maybe it's a little heavy handed, but you ought to start looking for Team Plasma too. Well, to be honest, I don't have that many minutes left on my camcorder, so I am I do apologize, but we'll have to stop this part here. So next time on Let's Play Pokemon Black and White, we are going to We are going to We're gonna go up against Team Plasma and we're gonna go up against the gym leader. I'll see you in my next part. Goodbye.